Well, I was going to stop for the day, but uh, I still got some space left in the hard drive, so let's record one more part. Do another half hour, see what time it is. Uh, okay, I have an idea of when to start, or stop. Let's go. Let's go to town. We got plenty of money to blow, so we're going to go blow it on stuff. Here's a suspicious looking fellow. Excuse me, but do you have a cousin named Sven? Um. What is that? Some sort of code? Yeah, Captain Obvious. Of course it's a code, you idiot. Never mind. Good night. No, no, want stuff. Excuse me, but do. Now oh, it's only you again. Do I have stuff? My cousin Sven sends his regards. I see. Let's talk business. Okay. You want to buy a map to the legendary lost treasure of Melee Island? Would I? Only no, not, one not you, Nico. Rare. <laughs> Very rare. Only 100 pieces of eight. Well, that sounds like a steal. I'll take it. It'll make a swell gift. There you go. You made a wise decision. Now get lost. All right, fine. Whatever, your mother. All right, let's, let's take a look at this little map we got here. I think I've been had. What? This is no map. It looks like dancing lessons. Dancing lessons? Do the monkey. Back, two, three, four, left, two, three, four, right, two, three, four, left, two, three, four. Uh, those are actually instructions on, th those are actually legit. <laughs> I just don't remember how to fucking read it correctly. Excuse me, but do, oh, it's only you again. I told you there was only one in existence. Now get lost. Okay, fine, fine. I don't, I don't want anything bit of this. Oh, you may have noticed I upped the sound a little bit. Hopefully it's hey, a little bit better now. Mess with my rat. Fuck you. <clears throat> I wouldn't want to touch your mother anyway. Hey, nice rat. Do you like rats? <laughs> <laughs> yes, especially in a light wine sauce. <laughs> Get away! <laughs> Do you guys know the sneaky looking man on the opposite corner? Saw you buying a map from that fellow over there. Have you looked at it yet? <laughs> Perhaps you should consider an alternate source. Our oh. maps are top quality, not like the bird caged liners you get from that clown across the street. Yeah. <laughs> no, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> These are actually copies of the minutes of the last meeting of the Melee Island PTA. Can't even give them away. Oh, really? Shut up. Want one? <laughs> no, but I'll take one if you give me two pieces of eight. Okay, that's fair. <laughs> that's fair. <laughs> They're so stupid. Say, are you guys pirates? No, we're a wandering circus troop. You look Ooh, like it. Rats scared away the elephant. <laughs> Your mom does Shut look pretty up. vicious. Of course we're pirates. You can't buy clothes like these off the rack. No, but you can find them in the what dumpster. Do you want? What's in the keg? Rum. Jam. Rum? Jam. Uh, rum. Both. Uh, rum and jam. It's an old pirate favorite. Everybody knows that. Oh, really? I'm really interested in this pirating thing. What do you want? Sorry I verbally abused your rat. <laughs> very intelligent creatures. <laughs> yeah, your mom doesn't look that dumb. More intelligent than him. I believe it. Why, there's a story around these parts that a bunch of rats actually crewed a ship here from Fable the Monkey Island. No, that's not right. It was actually a group of monkeys. Huh. 
That's amazing. But true. When they arrived, they sold the ship for a pretty penny. Only time I've seen anyone get the better of old Stan in a deal. <laughs> Interesting. I thought it was rats. I'm really interested in this pirating thing. What do you want? Uh, can I say anything else to them? Oh, yeah. How come you're on this street corner and not on a ship? Looting, pillaging, sacking, that sort of thing. Good question. Well, pirating hasn't been panning out so well for us. There Do are tell. some unnaturally talented pirates in the area right now. Focus on that naturally. Out of Monkey Island. So we've been pursuing alternate means of self-support. Like giving we'll away to money. Start up a circus. It was working out well until the rats scared off the elephant. That's <laughs> they were telling the truth. Now you've depressed us. Go home. Okay, jobbers. Bunch of jobber pirates. Oh, this looks promising. No. No. In. Yeah, bro. Let's see. There's a jar of bat drippings. Ew. A box that says assorted scales. A shaker full of monkey flakes. And some cat knuckles. Cat knuckles? Cat knuckles. How barbaric. Mmm. Chickens! Poor chickens. Poor chickens. Gee, I wonder what's in these baskets. Let's not find out. Ooh! Hmm. A rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. What do you know? What possible use could that have? Well, um... What may I help you with, son? Wait... Do you huh? see anything? What? I can sense your name is is Guybrush. Guybrush nose hair. No, no. Threepwood. <laughs> Guybrush Threepwood. <clears throat> Am I not right? Whoa! Wow, that was amazing. Do you know any other tricks? I do not deal in tricks. What I know your mom does. is the truth. So, my mind reading skills tell me it is your future you are interested in. I was hoping someone in a shop like this. this. Is something you really wish to know. Yes, tell me everything that's going to happen to me. I am getting a vision. Whoa! I see you taking You're tripping. a voyage. A long voyage. I see you captaining a ship. Yeah. I yeah. See... What? See what? I see a giant monkey. Yikes. <laughs> I see you inside the giant monkey. Ah, uh, gross. Gross. Wait. It's all becoming clear. Your journey will have many parts. Oh well, yeah. You will see things better left unseen. You will hear things better left unheard. You will learn things better left unlearned. I don't like the sound of this. Of things? I hate surprises. No. The time is not right to know. When you know your purpose, come see me. I will let you know then. Uh, okay. Whoa! Nice. Where'd she go? Give. Hmm. A rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. What possible use could Yoink. that have? Maybe no one will miss just this one thing. Yay! Taking my chicken and leaving. Hello? <laughs> Guess no one's here. Oh, darn. Oh, well, time to go. We got what we wanted. Okay, down the street we go. La 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 la. Now it's time to blow our cash. Whoops. Huh? What was that noise? Hello? Hmm? 
Anybody in here? Oh man, I'm in a dark alley by myself. This isn't good. Oh Hello. god, I'm gonna be raped. You know, bad things could happen to a person in a dark, deserted alley like this one. And at this time of night, nobody would be around to see it. You saw your Montron too. Did you hear something back in here too? No. I'd better get your name. Okay. I'm Guybrush Threepwood, and I'm a mighty pirate. I got the biggest balls of them all. Listen, Peepwood. Hey. Threepwood. Guybrush Threepwood. Well, whatever your name is, listen. Okay. I'm the sheriff around here. Sheriff Fester Shinetop. Take it from me. This is a bad time to be visiting Melee Island. Why is that? Very bad time. My advice to you is to find somewhere else to take your vacation. Really? Somewhere safer. This isn't a vacation, though. I won't well, be a mighty pirate. I feel much better knowing there's an officer of the law around. Me. Anything here? The circus poster. Ooh, a circus! I love a circus. Nothing we have to do in this alley. I was just trying to see if there's anything else we can just check out, just because. I don't see anything special about it. All right. I don't. Wait. Can we go back to the alley? I guess we can. Never mind. Anyway, let's go inside here. Ahoy there, fancy pants. I do have fancy pants. What's what say you, my friend? What do you want? Actually, um... I think I'd just like to browse. Oh, be my guest, fancy pants. Uh, okay, actually, I'll be back in just a second, sorry. Let's go over here first. To the doorway. Oh, uh, hello! It's locked. Oh. You. You gotta get me out of here! I'm a victim of society! Not to mention halitosis. <laughs> Ugh. Hey, it's hard to keep my breath minty fresh when there's nothing to eat in here but rats. Ew. Talk to death breath? No thanks. Oh, I can't talk to death breath anymore. Now we go back to the shop. La 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 la. Nothing in the church. Don't bother. Hey. Um, what? Ring bell for service. Now, we could try to steal stuff. I don't... Uh... I forgot what happens if we try to steal. Let's save and find out. It's not game over or anything. I think he just gets pissy with you or something. Slash master. When you want a sword as sharp as your wit. Yoink. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Aha! Caught you, you little thief. Maybe you'd oh, like to pay for that? Oh, okay, fine. About this sword. Yeah, what about it? I want it. I want it. Great. Best hundred pieces of eight you ever spent. What else do you want? Uh. I could really use a breath mint. Whew, you're telling me. Hey. Take one. Please. Take the whole roll. That'll be one piece of eight. <laughs> what else do you want? Okay, so now we got some Grago mints. I think I'd just like to browse. <laughs> we're not done yet. Whatever. Okay, so we're, we're gonna take the shovel. Pick up the shovel. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> Let's go talk to this, this old man Paul over here. Got a special on shovels today. I bet you do. Could you hurry up. What do you want? I want this shovel. About this shovel. Yeah, what about it? Uh, I want it. I want it. Great. Oh, it'll pay for itself, believe me. Yeah, you'll dig up 75 pieces of eight in no time. Okay. okay. Save some treasure for the rest of us, would you? <laughs> what else do you want? Um. I'm looking for the Swordmaster of Melee Island. The Swordmaster of Melee Island? Hmm. 
Now, I don't know. See, huh? nobody knows the whereabouts of her secret hideout. <laughs> nobody except me. I'd have to go and ask her if it's okay to show you the way. Pervy old man. Mm -hmm. I guess I could hike all the way over there. Once. Once. <laughs> and don't touch anything! Okay, you can't get away with stealing. Even when he's gone like this. He comes back immediately. Okay, so now what you want to do is you don't wait for him. Tail him. We're going to follow him to where the Swordmaster is. So he's an unreliable old man. So just cruise along, being sneaky sneaky. And don't worry, he won't catch you. Just cruise along as fast as you want. Follow that man, Pa! Walking with a cane, he's got a peg leg. It's not good for him. Okay, now where's he going? Is it? Oh, he's at the fork. Okay, he's in there. I need to keep an eye out for something too. Uh, pick up. Okay, now we got that. We needed that. Okay, now we go this way. We only have to do this once, by the way. Uh, do we need this too? I'm gonna take it anyway. I don't think strolling through the forest picking flowers is very good practice for being a pirate. Maybe not, but I'm gonna take them anyway. <laughs> Follow him up there. I think, I think the yellow flower is the only thing we needed to get. Yay! Almost there! There she is! I'm gonna be I sneaky, sneaky. Stay back here and eavesdrop. Yeah. Probably better. Hello again, Carla. Oh, he's using a sword I for thought his I told you to cane. get lost. Actually, I'm here on the business. This kid come into my store, see? See? Face it, you crusty old lech. Crusty you old make lech. any excuse just to come out here and bother me. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Well, cut it out. I'm sick of it. Take a hike and don't come out here again. Someone might follow you, and then I'd become another Melee Island tourist attraction. Hey, it's your loss, baby. Yeah, right. <laughs> now scram. Oh, you're about to become a tourist attraction. Hello! Hello, I'm Guybrush Streetwood, and I'm a mighty pirate. Hello! Talk to me. How dare you approach the Swordmaster without permission, which I surely didn't give you. You sure about that? Uh... I beg your pardon. I must talk to you. I doubt that. Really? Everyone who comes here is prepared to fight. I'm ready to fight. Let's be honest. You're here to prove yourself to the pirate leaders in hopes of one day being as immoral as they are. Yeah! Yep. Nailed it right on the head. Gee, you're smart. You are hard fiddle dee dee. in Captain Smirk's sword fighting class? Uh... uh what? Grade? Class? You mean you came here to take on the Swordmaster of Melee Island, possibly the greatest sword fighter in the entire Caribbean, without a single lesson in the art of fencing? Yep. Yep. <laughs> How did you expect to defend yourself? S waving my sword wildly. Gee, I don't know. Hoping for the best. I see. Obviously not with your razor-sharp wit. Ouch. I'd advise you to seek out Captain Smirks and get some real training. It would hardly be ethical, sporting, or even interesting to fight someone as unskilled as yourself. Oh, so fine. Jeez, what a bitch. I'm out. Screw you, hippies. Oh, wait, I can't go the same way as Manpa? Boo. Fine. I'll leave. Fine. I'll leave. But you'll wish I'd stayed. You know. Gets awful lonely out here in the woods and stuff.
Okay, so, um, yeah, we need sword fighting lessons. Let's go over here. Dig in the music. It's even good in the old days. Uh, hello, please. Well, I think I'll knock. Well, let's knock, man. It'd only be polite. <laughs> He's punching the door. What Hello. do you want, you wimpy little spineless maggot? Um. Could you train me to be better than the swordmaster? Better than the swordmaster? Huh? <laughs> you? Yeah. <laughs> you hey. could never be half the sword fighter Carly is, even with hours of hard work and sweat and blood. I remember fighting side by side with Carla at Port Royal. The local constabulary had us cornered. Constabulary. Like we done for. But then she said, "But I digress. Oh. You just don't have what it takes." Yeah, I do. I have the sword. I do so have what it takes. Yeah. You do not. I do so. <laughs> you do not. I do so. No, I like your spirit. I'll do what I can. <laughs> of course, it'll cost you. What? Did you see my sign? Uh, I usually charge 30 pieces of eight for a big job like this one. What do you got? I've got 30 pieces of eight. Well, I've got 30 pieces of eight. Oh, this is dead chicken. Say no more, say no more. Let's see your sword. Okay, check it out. <laughs> this is deadly looking chicken. Yes. This is a nice one. Let's get to it. A slash master. I think that's what it was okay, called. Okay, you maggot. Why don't you whip that sword out and let's see what you can do with it. Right here? Ooh, that's gross. Oh, that sword. Boy, you fight like a dairy farmer. How dare you? I usually don't waste my time with vermin like yourself. But seeing as this LeChuck thing has put a cramp on business, I got no choice. I need the money. Yes, I can see this is going to take some special measures. Oh. Just want you to know, I don't do this with everyone. Uh? It's only because I feel that special student-mentor pieces of eight bonding <laughs> that I'm going to these lengths. I'm going to put you up against the machine. The machine? The machine? Is this going to hurt? <laughs> I love that. <laughs> Holy Yikes. crap. Come at me. It's... Don't be afraid Come at me, bro. You hurt me. No! Beat first, then lunge. No! Beat first, then lunge. No! Beat first, then lunge. Use your forte against the foible. Hours later. It randomizes what it you're says. You're starting to get the hang of it. More hours later. Not bad. You've got good form. Now I'm going to let you in on the true secret of sword fighting. Oh? Sword fighting is kind of like making love. What? It's not always what you do, but what you say. Any fool pirate can swing a sharp piece of metal around and hope to cut something. It works for me. But the pros, they know just when to cut their opponent with an insult. <laughs> one that catches them off guard. You see, kid... Your wit's got to be twice as sharp as your sword. And this is where the grinding Let's comes try in. Let's a couple of insults out, shall we? Okay. Imagine this. We're fighting up a storm. Just like Carla and I were doing at Port Royal. I bet you were fighting. There's a sudden break in the fighting, and I say to you... You fight like a dairy farmer. You respond with... Um... <laughs> so is your mother. That's what I'd say. <laughs> I can see we've got a lot of work to do here. You should have responded with something like, How appropriate. You fight like a cow. You see, it's razor-sharp wit like that that wins fights. Really? Let's try another. Imagine this. You're trapped up against a wall. My sword just slashed two cuts into your face. No, it wasn't. That's a puzzle. Possible Soon ball. you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. You respond with? Um. How appropriate. <laughs> you fight like a cow. 
No, no, no. That was the response from the last insult. Doesn't even make sense when used here. Oh. A correct response to soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab would have been something like first you better stop waving it around like a feather duster see razor sharp <laughs> i guess now i suggest you go out there and learn some insults i can't help but feel like i've been ripped off i'm sure you're feeling something similar <laughs> Good times. Okay, okay. Now, grinding. I'm going to show you a bit of what this is all about. Um, I don't know if I'm going to show the grinding on camera or not, because there is some funny stuff, but it also gets repetitive. Dirty, rotten pirate. Let's just pick a fight with any of them. No. No, get over here. There we go. A pirate can be dangerous to your health. Where's your shoes, bro? My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. You're gonna lose a lot of fights, by the way. Soon you'll be wearing my sword like a. So what you do is you use an insult. Oh, I am rubber. You are glue. If he comes back with a bad comeback, uh, you gain some progress on beating him. Although it doesn't really matter if you beat him or not. Uh, if you want to grind, um, you, you use one of those stupid insults. What an idiot. Ah, is that the best you can come up with? Uh-huh. Now he'll beat you back a little bit. You're no match for my brains, you poor fool. Okay, that's a new insult. We don't know the answer to it, so, uh... Uh, just because. How appropriate. <laughs> you fight like a cow. So now we have a new insult. I've spoken with apes more polite than you. Now we have another new insult. How appropriate. <laughs> you fight like a cow. <laughs> I give up. You win. Right. Now we use this against some other guys. What should be wanted? Scurvy lover. Your mom. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. Yeah, I'll show a few minutes of this and yeah. Uh yeah. You're no match for my brains, you poor fool. Now we need to get the response Might to this. Be in real trouble if you ever use them. Now we have the response for that one. See how it works, there kitties. No words for how disgusting you are. How appropriate. <laughs> you fight like a cow. <laughs> Nobody's ever drawn blood from me, and nobody ever will. That's another new insult. Uh. I am rubber, you are glue. Look behind you, a three-headed monkey! I guess we have a new response now. No, 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 no. Over here, oh, over here. Catch this guy. Hey, this better be important. It is important. Ever notice how all these roads start to look the same? <laughs> yeah, now that you mention it, they do. Ah, it's probably just that we're tired. Sure is. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. Oh, uh, let's see. Nobody's ever drawn blood from me, and nobody ever will. You run that fast? Ha, <laughs> there's our response. You make me want to puke. Uh. <laughs> uh, could you repeat that? I didn't quite get it. I said, <laughs> you make me want to puke. Yeah, we don't have that one. Oh, yeah? Oh, uh, one more chance to beat him back. I've heard you were a contemptible snake. We're getting lots of new insults. I'm shaking. I'm shaking. Yikes, nice move. Okay, let's do like two more. 
Let's do two more and then I'm gonna grind the rest off camera. And there's some really funny ones here, but yeah. I don't wanna do all of them on camera. Better be important. Important. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. Well, let's see. I don't oh, have this one yet. You make me want to puke. You make me think somebody already did. Burn! Got that response People now. People fall at my feet when they see me coming. <laughs> How appropriate. That's a new one. You fight like a cow. I once owned a dog that was smarter than you. Another new one. You run that fast? <laughs> uncle! Uncle! One more. Move out of the way, or I cuts my way through. Or I cuts my way through. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. Uh... People fall at my feet when they see me coming. Yeah. I'm shaking. I'm shaking. Oh, I didn't have that one. Uh. I once owned a dog that was smarter than you. Let's try that one. He must have taught you everything you know. Burn. <laughs> I've heard you were a contemptible sneak. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I am rubber, you are glue. I don't want to waste my responses just in case. My handkerchief will wipe up your blood. I'm shaking. I'm shaking. Oh dear. I give up. You win. Okay, that, that's the, that's the gist of that. So, um, Stopping a whoa. It can be dangerous to your health. Okay, one more, I guess. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. Uh, da, 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 da. My handkerchief will wipe up your blood. So, you got that job as a janitor after all. Ouch! My feelings. You have the manners of a beggar. <laughs> How appropriate. You fight like a cow. <laughs> I've heard you were a contemptible sneak. I, mean, I should use that to start with. They keep using that one. How appropriate. You fight like a cow. Yikes. Nice move. <clears throat> okay, okay, okay. That's enough. That's enough. Let's save. Excellent. Now then, uh, I'm going to go grind insults. Yay. Whoever heard of fucking grinding in an adventure game? Yeah. Anyway, I'll catch you later.